Donald Trump criticized Hillary Clinton for her characterization that half of his supporters belonged in a basket of deplorables, denouncing the comment as an explicit attack on the American voter and suggesting that it makes her unfit for the presidency. No stranger to make his, making his own sweeping negative characterizations of large groups of people, Trump nonetheless deployed the remark as the foundation for a new campaign theme. The message is very clear. Clinton is divisive, while Trump is the candidate representing all Americans. You cannot run for president if you have such contempt in your heart for the American voter, Trump said. You can't lead this nation if you have such a low opinion of its citizens. Trump is clearly on attack mode as Clinton recovers from her pneumonia attack. While she takes a few days away from the campaign trail, Trump is going all in. Trump said Clinton's comments were aimed at those in uniform, whether in the military or in law en enforcement. This is Trump's version of what Hillary said. These were the people Hillary Clinton so viciously demonized, said Trump, who demanded that Clinton issue a full apology. She divides people into baskets as though they were objects, not human beings. Trump expanded the definition to those slighted as a cross-section of his supporters. While my opponent calls you deplorable and irredeemable, I call you hard-working American patriots who love their country and want a better future for all our people, he said. Clinton, of course, has said she regrets using the term half to describe the proportion of Trump supporters she considers deplorables, but she didn't back down from describing his campaign as largely built on prejudice and paranoia. The comments, though, combined with Clinton's health scare Sunday at the 9-11 memorial. She was captured on video struggling to step into a waiting van, and her doctor later announced that she had been diagnosed with pneumonia. All this could reshape the race, in which Clinton holds very slim leads in several battleground states. Bad timing for the Clinton camp. Trump and his allies pounced on Clinton's deplorable remark, but remained mostly disciplined and silent, surprisingly, on Qu Clinton's health. A new ad set to air in the battleground states of Ohio, Florida, Pennsylvania, and North Carolina is squarely aimed at the voters the Trump campaign says Clinton is vilifying. You know what's deplorable? Hillary Clinton viciously demonizing hardworking people like you, Trump's ad is going to say. Trump and his aides are rejoicing, and they have predicted that Clinton's statement will be damaging, especially coming at this time in the race, with less than 60 days to go before Election Day, and early voting is already on underway. When I saw this in its full form, and I saw the anger with which she said it, Trump told a news channel, I think it's the single biggest mistake of the political season. But Trump has also attacked Americans who don't intend to vote for him, hurling insults which have no basis in fact.